Hey, y'all. We having a new addition to the family. I have something to tell y'all. I'm sick. The kids are hollering. I'm trying to get this video done before the sun go down. These are my babies. Yes. <laughs> all my cheering. These are all my hair children. Okay. No, Melissa. We no. We not. No, we not going there. No, I'm not pregnant. Ooh, I'm in heaven. I'm in heaven. But I do have some babies. <laughs> yeah let's jump into it mm -hmm. hey guys welcome back for another video and in today's video we are going to go through my most used my favorite oops my favorite products of 2018 so let's jump right in if you hadn't subscribed to the channel i can wait my kids are holler i'm sick let me blow my nose i can let me let me take drink some tea while you subscribe i would love for you to subscribe to the channel you guys we're going to have so much fun in 2019, have some series coming up, and I am going to be doing a Will I Buy It Wednesday. So comment down below and let me know what you guys would love for me to review, love for me to try. Uh, you want to hear my thoughts on it. You may already have your thoughts, but you like, girl, I just want to know what you thinking about this. What you thinking? You know, things that make you go, hmm. But I have everything here in this bucket, and we're going to go through it. There are some things that I have emptied and finished those off i have not repurchased them but they were definitely best of 2018. let's start off with the ones that i have over here y'all these are most used products in this one i did do new in my makeup and skincare and that one's already on the channel i'll throw it up in the cards if you want to check out the best of beauty of skincare in terms of skincare and hair care but this is best of beauty natural hair or hair in general and the diva curl no poo decadence even this one and the regular one because i had a 32 ounce of that one love this this is my most used cleansing product for my hair absolutely love it and it will be it's a staple it's an hg hg just meaning holy grail holy grail meaning that i will always have this in my makeup not my makeup it'll always be in my curly hair collection this is for my curly hair now i do have items for my straight hair but this one is for my curly absolutely love it if I were going to co-wash, I don't do that as much, but I think I might go back to co-washing. This is the Diva Curl One Condition Decadence. I really like this as well. It's a great uh, detangler. Um, Wash Day Wonder, I have done a review on that. That one is detangling on another level, but you can detangle with this one and you can detangle with you know this one, but I really like these and um, co-washing, I would do this. And for just cleansing my hair once a week, I would do this. Okay, favorite oil. I just have been loving this. This is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil in Lavender. This is from the brand Sunny Isle. I love this. I am going to put it in a bottle. I wish it was in a better bottle, but I am going to put it in here and cut it with some other oils. But I absolutely love this. My hair reacts so well to castor oil. This one has an amazing scent and I believe it's also sodium free. And it's a replenish and it's no salt added, 100% natural. And I when, when my hair is curly, I try to be as natural with my hair products, but there are some that I just totally ditched in 2018 eco styler uh yeah i did I, I i said it i said it i know some of y'all love eco styler but i had to ditch that one it was my favorite for years and then once started burning my scalp that's all it take that's all it take let's talk about another detangler i've talked about this in a products that every high porosity girl needs this is the tahitian gardenia flower and mango butter the curl defining detangler this is so good i use this more in the spring and summer than in the fall and winter just because this does contain glycerin but my hair tends to not react as much i think it's further down on the list and it's like yeah it's like next to the last product but i really like this my hair reacts really well to this and it's so inexpensive and that is a really good detangler okay so let's talk about hair mist this is the sotanicals hair surreal napalicious 
kink drink. I also talked about this, I think, in one of my favorite. I think this was in my favorite hair mess that are glycerin free in my glycerin free series. I'll throw that up in the cards if you want to check out the playlist of all my glycerin free products. But this is amazing. I really like it. It's really great as a refresher. As a matter of fact, let me refresh my hair right now. Y'all, if a refresher doesn't have a good mist, that is half the battle. Okay, you have lost the battle if it's not a good mist. If it doesn't have a good mister, that one has a really good mister. I love that. It smells amazing. It smells like luxurious juices and baddies. Oh, girl, that ain't nothing but ultra perm. Do y'all know where that's from? And have you watched Coming to America? Anyway, the Sultanicals Napalicious Chink. Chink, chink, chink. <laughs> the Soul Tanicals Napalicious Kink Drink is my boo. I love this. Okay, deep conditioners. Now, Camille Rose Coconut Water Penetrating Treatment is so amazing. It is my favorite from the drugstore, but I also have my Maui Moisture. That one's a great one. And I think in the beginning of the year, I did a curly routine under. $20 I believe and that's in there I'll throw that throw that up I just repurchased it but and I'm gonna show you guys um, a natural hair and body haul that I I'm coming with I am budgeting so but I did get that but that is coming this is the deep curl deep seat repair I did do a review on this this is a strengthening this is one that does not make my hair hard and i really really like this in condition in conjunction to the melt into moisture that one is really good that one is worth the money from sephora this one is as well if you're looking for something that's for curly hair specifically and for hair strengthening diva curl just got you like all the way down you know what i mean those are the things that I rinse out of my hair. I'm good with products that I can rinse out of my hair. If it's staying in my hair, Diva Curl is not the place for me. But Diva Curl holds me down with my, my cleanser, my co-wash, my deep conditioner, my strengthening conditioner. Yes. Diva Curl. I got you. Or you got me, boo. In terms of hair growth, the Nioxin Hair Booster, I've talked about this in how to repair your natural hair. I do have a video on that and I'll throw that up in the cards but this is so good this is like a hair serum that helps it's like it boosts your hair growth this is amazing if you have alopecia or you have your hair has fallen out because of postpartum shedding this is something great to have and you just massage it now it will revert the curl so if you are reverted back to a curl so if you're wearing your hair straight I don't recommend this this is if you're washing your hair just to use it but you have to keep it in your hair don't rinse it out but this is so so good and I use this a lot but I could use it a lot more this hair this makes my hair thicker too if you have fine thin hair this is a hair booster it is to me I feel like it is it says for thin looking hair and it does make my hair look thick so I really like that so y'all that was me screeching at a halt because I totally forgot about my aquas hair turban y'all I'm sick forgive me I am forgetting stuff in this video but I cannot go without this hair turban that I wore all year almost all year okay let's get back to the regular scheduled video thank you so this is my melt into moisture by diva curl this is a matcha butter conditioning mask this is the travel size but I have the larger size this is 1.5 ounces thank you diva curl because anything under one ounce I can use it in my hair okay we talked about that we talked about that with another brand but melt into moisture the larger size I feel like it's still worth the money I know it's a pricey item but I feel like I'm getting a salon hold it down there are drugstore things that is on that level but Diva Curl I was introduced to Diva Curl by my hairstylist and this is a salon product so it's not it's not cheap nothing in Diva Curl is cheap but you can find sales so and use those Ulta bucks, y'all. Y'all can get it from Ulta. But this melanin to moisture is so good. And then the strengthening repair. I told y'all. Diva Curl got me. My favorite gel has been the Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic. I'm using the Hello Curly. It's in my shower. It's in my bathroom. and uh, But it's still Uncle Funky's Daughter. I do have a backup of that. But that was my favorite gel. And it is glycerin free. I absolutely love that. I am going to be trying some other gels. I have another gel that I really like. And I have not done a review on it. Let me just show y'all. 
main choice this is glycerin free y'all and it's from the drugstore it is the main choice crystal orchid biotin infused gel let me know if you guys want a full review on this and how it looks i do have it in my hair today and this is a two-day mm, this is the second day of a wash and go so i am going to try it in terms of a twist out and everything but it is glycerin free and i really like how it does my hair and i feel like i can kind of select my edges with this i should have used this before this video Anyway, this, let me know if you want a full review. I am going to be diving into some main choice and giving you guys the specs and what I think about main choice, but I really do like this gel and it is glycerin free. I'm so happy because this replaced my Eco Styler gel. So there you go. Those are my most used, my favorite <sighs> hair care products of 2018 I will list everything down below even the ones that I haven't mentioned and I may have forgotten just a few just a little just itty bitty uh, because I don't want to talk about like the apple sorghum they don't make this anymore and it was my favorite oil and it's the most used I use it all the time besides the sunny aisle so I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video